You know what nobody likes? A rat. Not just in prison, but in life. In grade four, when you're lighting off Roman candles behind the portables after school, and little Johnny Anderson tells Mrs. Langman about it, and nobody likes that kid. Then 30 years later, the kid with the firecrackers isn't the pain in the ass to society. Little Johnny Anderson is. If nobody has nipped his rodent behavior in the bud, he'll grow into old man Jonathan Anderson and become one of the 11,000 rats who snitched on their neighbors last year for not shoveling their sidewalks. This year, we're on pace to double that number, and the city's asking everybody to just relax because they can't handle the crybabies. Listen, I don't doubt that there are a lot of negligent, lazy, terrible homeowners and tenants out there whose lawns run rampant with dandelions in the summer and have slick sidewalks in the winter, but there's not 11,000 of them. I'd wager that the majority of those 311 complaint liners are the real crappy neighbors. You know how to be a crappy neighbor? Rat and whine and complain. You know how to be a good neighbor? Do their walks once in a while, and maybe you can guilt them into being a little more responsible. Shame is a much more powerful motivator than a warning from the city. In the meantime, I'll just shut my big yep.